guys, it's Lexi, and today I'm going to be doing another episode of Hashtag Ask Lexi. And I feel like it's been so long since I did my last one, and a lot of you guys were requesting that I do another Q&A. So, here I am, and I'm excited to be filming it for you guys. As always, all of the questions were taken from Instagram and Twitter, and I'll be featuring the users who sent in these questions. So, if you want to get featured in the next episode of Ask Lexi, make sure you're following me on Twitter and Instagram. Both are at It's Me Lexi One. And as you can tell, I'm just at my normal Q&A filming spot. And without further ado, let's get started with these questions. What is your favorite fast food restaurant? I don't know if it completely counts, but I really like Chipotle. I love getting their bowls. What kind of foundation do you use? I love you so much, and how can you be so perfect? I love you too, but I am not perfect in any way at all. And personally, I don't wear foundation. I just don't really like the way it feels on my skin. So unfortunately, I don't really have a good recommendation. How do you feel about Ariana Grande licking the donuts and getting investigated? By the way, I love you, Lexi. I love you too, and my personal opinion on it I forgive her, I still support her, I know that she definitely made a mistake and I don't agree with all of her choices because she is human and she does make mistakes. She definitely made a mistake but she owned up and apologized for it and she's still young, she's only 22 and I think that we all make mistakes and have like our off days. It's just that celebrities have their mistakes blown way out of proportion and like publicized so that everyone can judge them which makes it a lot harder. So I know she definitely made a mistake and I don't agree with the situation completely, but I still love and support her just as much. Favorite TV show? My favorite TV show of like all time is Gossip Girl, but right now I am very into Big Brother. What's your favorite video you filmed? I really like the way that my Hawaii lookbook came out. Where would you like to live in the future? I would definitely love to live in New York City. I've thought about living in LA. What's your recent favorite song? I really like the song called XO by The Eden Project. Advice for starting a YouTube channel. I actually have like a whole YouTube 101 series, so if you wanna go watch that video, I'll have it like right here to go click. And I just talk about all sorts of like YouTube getting started, editing, making friends, that sort of stuff. So just click around here. What did your last text message say? All right, so my last text message was to my friend V and it said, I see it, an older version though because he said that Caitlyn Jenner kind of looks like Lana Del Rey, and yeah, that was my reply. Favorite activity you have done in Hawaii? I think that my favorite thing I did in Hawaii was go surfing. Um, I really enjoyed it, and I would definitely love to go surfing again. But fun fact, I also broke the law in Hawaii. I don't know if I completely broke the law. Basically, I love Hawaii license plates. I thought they were super cute. So I took a picture of one, posted it on Instagram, and I got like a hundred comments from you guys saying how it was illegal, broke the law, I needed to delete it, and I didn't know it was illegal, but apparently it is, and yeah, I just deleted that real quick. What year of high school are you in? I hate thinking about school, but I am going into 10th grade, even though I still look like I'm 10. What are your summer essentials? Love you so much. I love you too, and I have really been liking baseball caps for summer, so I thought I would show you this little one that I actually like custom designed. It has a little Snapchat logo on it. And I got it from this website called Snapmade, which basically they have like hats, coasters, t-shirts, hoodies, candles, all sorts of stuff that you can customize with any um, of your own pictures or designs that they have on the website. So I'll just do a little mini haul from them. So I got the little Snapchat hat, of course, that I just showed you. I got a really cute like, um, sunset palm tree ringer tee and then I got a little coaster to put drinks on that has my dog on it and yeah all these things are super cute and I will have a link below to Snapmade and I would highly recommend them the products are really good quality do you believe in equality yes I for sure do how excited are you about your new clothing line I'm so excited and I really hope you guys enjoy all of the products I'll have a link below like always what are your thoughts on the don't judge challenge no offense to you if you want to do the don't judge challenge or you have done it I just don't really understand the point of it though because they're calling it the don't judge challenge but then as like the first half of the video that's supposed to be their ugly part, they're like drawing on acne, unibrows, glasses, but none of that stuff makes you ugly. And really that's just making fun of people who do have those things. So I think the part where you're just like posing and showing off yourself, that's fine. It's cool to like uh, love yourself, but you don't have to like make fun of other people's insecurities to do that. So that's kind of my take on it. How did you grow your hair so fast? A lot of people have been asking me this lately and saying like hair goals and stuff, so thank you for that. First of all, it's really nice, but I don't think I've done anything in particular. 
Um, I mean, all I do is just not cut my hair that often. I don't have any special trick. I just get my hair cut like maybe once every six months to a year, which is not that often, and just get a really short trim, like barely anything. Just get really short trims to keep your hair healthy, but not too much. I know that's probably not the advice you're looking for, but really, I don't do anything special. What is the hundredth picture on your camera roll? I will insert that picture for you here. Can you sing your favorite song with your mouth full of marshmallows? I dare you to try it. Hold on one second. Now, I couldn't find marshmallows right now, but I did find some freeze-dried raspberries, so I think this is just going to have to work. Um, I'm a little scared. Now, I don't know what song I'm gonna sing since my favorite song is always changing, but I'll just think of a random song to sing. answering in this week's Ask Alexi episode. I hope that you enjoyed watching and yeah, I will see you in my next video. Thanks so much for watching. Bye.